um, hello everyone, and I found this child. Hmm? A kid all by himself? It's not safe here. Aww. Oi. Hey! There's no place for a kiddo alone. It's not safe. Go home to your mom. I don't want to. I don't like my mom when she's mad. Mm. What? Your mom got angry with you. Yup! I want to buy something from the super cool vending machine, but she flipped out. A super cool vending machine. Not like this one here. Mm. It's nothing like that. It's a lot bigger and it lit up with its bright lights. It's really, really cool. Why did your mom get angry over that? I don't know. My mom is always really nice, but she got really, really mad this time. She looked scary. Okay, so what are you doing here? My mom went out, so I took the train here. You came all the way here by yourself. That's pretty gutsy. I gotta hand it to you, kid. <laughs> I did a lot of chores and saved up all my allowance. Good for you. It's tough for a kid your age to save money. Yup! I walked through really the hard to get this far. But... Well, what's wrong? I want to buy something from the cool vending machine, but it's at the back alley and it's dark and it's kind of scary. A dark alley is dangerous for a kid by himself. Got it. And you're right. You're smart not to go into a dark alley alone. Yup. That's why I can decide what to do. Well, I get what's holding the kid back, but does he want a soda that badly? Maybe I'll just go get it for him myself. Sure, I'll buy it for him. Okay, you win. I'll go buy it from the super cool vending machine of yours. You you be good and wait here, deal? <laughs> You'll do that for me! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Don't expect anyone to be as happy to, uh, to be so happy over this. So, where is the special vending machine? It's over this way. Follow me. I hope I don't get mugged. Oi. Oi! Uh. It's in here! Okay. This seems like I'm gonna get jumped. Where it is? Huh? Nani? Oh! No! That... Oh. Oi. Oi. Uh, you're cool in the machine. It is... Uh, really that one there? Uh, yup. Is something wrong, mister? So, you... um, The kid was looking at the vending machine, shilling adult merchandise. No wonder his mom flipped, uh, flipped her lid. Yeah. See? Isn't it, isn't it big and cool? There's no way I can give that junk to a kid. I hate to disappoint him, but I have to turn him down. Sorry, kid, I can't keep my promise. That vending machine is way out of your league. Uh -huh. Go home to your mother. Huh? Why? Tell me why. You don't need to know just yet. I already know something about that vending machine. That, that's a secret magazine in it. Those magazines are covered in shrink wrap. They must be super important to be protected like that. My friend's, my friend's big brother said so. The shrink's wrap, not for protection, not for the magazine anyway. You'll understand one day. But I want to understand now. They said it'd be really educational. It's not something you need to learn now. Look, I'm an adult, uh, but even I don't know very much. It's deep. Ah, oh, it's not fair. You said you'd go buy it for me. Grown-ups always lie. Am I gonna grow up to be a liar too? I don't wanna. When I was a kid, I used to think adults were unfair too. Yet here I am, just another lying grown-up. Alright, a man doesn't go back on his word. I'll keep my promise and go buy your magazine. Uh -huh. Oh, you will? Uh. Of course, but you have to keep it a secret from your mom. No matter what. <laughs> Yay, you're getting my magazine! Yay! You keep it down. You wanna be treated like a man, you gotta be patient and quiet. Ah, uh, yep. Sorry, mister, and thank you very much for helping me. You shouldn't expect too much. What a dilemma. I made that kid a promise, but I can't really give that stuff to a child. What do I do? This kid is the picture of a bright-eyed innocence. I can't give him the magazine, but I can fulfill my promise to buy it. Okay, I got this. It's dangerous for you, so stay back. Let's do this. Okay, what what are we gonna do? Hmm? Oh, someone's coming. <sighs> oh, I'm exhausted. <clears throat> Finally, a few minutes to myself.
office workers on their break. Mm. Huh? What do you suppose that man is doing there? Oh, you know what's at the end of that alley. Oh, right. He must be lonely at night. I'm s I'm surrounded. Better back off for now. But how could could he bring a child of him? People are so shameless these days. Shh! He's coming this way. What's wrong, mister? Aren't you going to buy it? Uh, well, yeah, but see, that's not it. I, uh, if those nosy women see me buying it, there's no telling what they'll say about me. I might have to wait them out. <gasps> oh! Hi there, President Kiryu. Wait, what? Mm. Huh? What? What, are you, what is she doing here? Is she, is she his, uh, his mom? Nani. What's Marina doing here? Why here? Why now? Mister? It's nothing. What are you doing here? Oh my, let me guess she's on one of those mags. What brings you out here? Oh, just wandering around. What are you doing here? I take my break at this park every now and then. I usually read or just relax on that bench. Aha. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Ah, sorry. We're in a hurry here. Oh, of course. See you then. I'll have to back off and ho and hope for a chance. Wait. Does he have a son? Oh no. Kiri must reach the vending machine at the back of the alley without attracting attention. If he is spotted, Kiri will become flustered and retreat to the starting point. Kiri can choose to abandon the vending machine quest by speaking to the boy. Begin your dubious quest. Oh, President Kiri, what are you doing here? No, nothing, just taking a walk. Uh, sorry, I'm in a hurry here. Of course, I'll see you then. Yeah! Okay, so this is going to be interesting. Do they turn around? Oh, that man, do you think he's going to buy something from that man with you? Uh, you know, he'd probably start drooling and frothing at the mouth or, over the notion of making a small talk. Men are Neanderthals, their minds <laughs> are always in the gutter. I better retreat, there's no telling what they might say. Okay, so this is not as, not as simple as I thought it would be. So she's gonna patrol like that. Office clock on break. Oh! By the back. Oh my god, she spotted me too. God damn it. Marina! Go away, Marina! God damn it. <laughs> I made a guess if that would walk. This is far from cool. No way! You're my hero! Please, please, can I have it? Before I give you this, you have to promise something. Sure! Uh. This is important. You can't open this magazine until you get home. Even there, you can't let your mother see it, ever. Huh? What am I supposed to read it then? You can't let anyone know about it. You can only read it when you're alone. Okay, I got it. And... 
there's more? This is the last thing. Don't hide it under your bed. It's not as safe as you think. Okay, I don't really get it, but this sounds like it's pretty important. Good boy. You handed the shrink-wrapped magazine to the boy. Thank you, mister. I've treasured it forever. It's really not that valuable. There will come a day when you don't need it anymore. Just be careful getting it home. Yep, thank you very much. <laughs> Grow up strong, kid. I, d I, I, d I don't like the fact that I got a kid a porno mag. Oh my gosh, she was spying on me. It takes so much to be a man. <laughs> well, that was an experience. Uh, anyways. I don't know what now. Oh my god, that's so loud. Uh, let's go check in with our postcard thing. I'm sure that gets some progress. Oh, um, excuse me. What the fuck are you doing here? Oh, it's you. Didn't I, didn't I see it? Uh, Queen, Queen, are you Samus Dungeon? Oh no, he's the SM guy. Oh, right, with Ayu the Dominatrix. What was your name? Ayu Sama calls me masochistic man, and big, and slave, and I know. I see. Thank you for your help at the play playroom the other day. I, well, uh, help? Since that day, Ayu Sama has reached a whole new level as a Dominatrix. Perhaps it's thanks to you. That's great! There are no words to express my humble, humblest gratitude to you. So instead of work, I would like to thank you with deeds. Deeds? The word, of, uh, the word on the street is that you're running a business. I thought perhaps I'd be able to use the skills from my day job as a consultant to serve. I mean, help you. Whoa, you're a consultant. I never would have guessed, but sure, I would love to get your help. <laughs> the more straight-laced you are on the streets, the more likely you are to be a freak in the sheets. Uh, cool. So he's only good in two areas. This is wonderful. I'm looking forward to serving you. Please make me squeal like a little piggy sc Oh, shut up. You do realize you're not even trying to hide your freak flag right now, right? I guess it doesn't matter. Bro, he literally did, did all of it in front of you. I don't think he cares. First things first. It's on! As always, we kick off the show with shoutouts to our faithful listeners by reading out their postcards. Come on, Dolce. Read the postcard from Judgment Kaze. Aww. It's time already, too bad. Mm. Well, like, as I said, I have a lot of stories, so. I have a lot of post uh, postcards, so I can just keep sending them. What should I write about? It needs to be a topic. The Yokomochi Silvers. Yeah, let's write about that, why not? I'll write about meeting the Yokomochi Silvers without giving any secrets away. Wait. Hi. That might be a bad idea. Huh? I hope that doesn't expose anything. Oh, give me that money. Yes. Oh, yes. Money. Let's see. Let's invest first. Okay, so we need something. I don't know what this, what the triangle means. I don't think triangle means good. Since she's a food person, we need to continue to going down that path. This is for the kinky people. Ah, uh, sure, go ahead. Yep, I assume as much. This is your field, so go ahead. Okay, we almost got one at A, which is cool. Mm-hmm. 
I, I like I like what I have going right now, so. Yep. Stop collecting. Thank you guys, and let's get back on the road. Cut it out! Mm. Huh? Uh huh? Shut the hell up, woman! Like I said before, I want to see that Kiryu man, or whatever his name is. Hurry it up! <sighs> like I already told you, he's not here right Oi. now. Hey! I'm right here. What do you want? Mr. President! Oh! You're the president? Ha! <laughs> Wait a minute! You? I bumped into you on the street before, right? Huh, <sighs> you're so you're so you're President Kiryu, eh? And you're the Legia King, so what do you want with us? I've got better things to do than reminisce, uh, reminisce with you. Hey now, you come into my door and mess with my business and that's all you have to say for yourself? Where's your manners, man? I don't see what your problem is, I'm running a legit business here. Don't you get it? I'm telling you, that is my problem. Excuse me, I need a sip of tea. Uh, so! So, what's this about? <laughs> Beating around the bushes in my style. If you get any of my way, you get a little visit from me and my boys. You remember what happened to you? I'm annoying, right? <laughs> You're rotten to the core. I can't let you let you keep your strong stranglehold over this area. <laughs> I'll shoot your pie hole right up so you can't give me up like that. Hey, take your shit off! Sir! Why don't you educate this idiot prison? Yes, sir. Don't blame me if you end up dead, asshole. I don't think you guys realize. You are in the, in the danger zone. Oh, really? Oh my god, I got backstabbed. It's shit. Oh, here is that. Where's the knife? Oh my god! <laughs> what? Kitty, why are you tired? <laughs> Take a shield, I didn't stand a chance, eh? Not bad, not bad. Looks like you can walk the walk. You know what? I think I'll let you off the hook for today. But if you piss me off again, you're dead meat. I'll take you out myself. And don't, don't you forget. And if you die, all your properties will become mine. I'm perfectly fine with managing things that way. If you don't want to die, get out. If you don't get out, I'll kill you. Simple, right? Think about it, man. Don't screw with, m with the five billionaires. <gasps> Mr. President, are you alright? Uh. Yeah, I'm fine. The Leisure King will do anything to get what he wants. I'll, I'll probably have to fight him one of these days. I need to be careful. I don't think he'll be that tough, Kiryu. Let's be honest. Okay, cool. Uh, now that we've got that sorted, let's just... Let's go to your main quest. Because, you know, we've been doing a lot. Okay, let's have a look. They haven't been here since the beginning of the game. So that's gonna be quite interesting. Hi, Tachibana. What's up? Tachibana. Nande Kokori. Kesa Tsuga Shirabe Tsukushita Gemba des. Mo Shinhani Nitsnagariona Shogoa. Nogotima Senyo. 
く分かっているうちの情報網を使ってクゼを洗いましたもしクゼがあなたをはめた黒幕であればここでの殺しのために殺し屋を雇ったはずですですがクゼの周りにそういう動きはありませんでしたどういうことだつまりあなたに殺しの濡れ衣を着せた黒幕はうんおそらくクゼじゃありません他にいます何今私が掴んでいる情報はここまでですそれをあなたにお伝えしようと思いましてねそのためだけにあんたはここにええですがご心配なく私はカムロ町から姿を消しはしません堂島組がうちの動きに気づくまでもう少し時間がかかると思っていましたがそれでも想定の範囲内ですその割に小田は淡くってたらな小田さんにもまだ伝えてないことですが実はうんこの殻の一粒の所有者を見つけましたあっさん訳あってまだ接触はできていませんですがその人物を内側押さえ殻の一粒を手に入れれば堂島組が我々に土地を売ってほしいと頭を下げることになるこの土地の価値はそれだけの力を生むんですですから桐生さんあなたにはそれまでの間死なずにいていただきます無理な相談でしょうか殻の一粒の持ち主はいつ抑えられるんだ一日くださいただし多言無用ですたとえ相手が錦山さんや柏木さんであってもあんたを今天野に売り渡せば俺は堂島組に狙われずに進むんだがなあなたがそういう人なら私はこんなところにのこのこ顔を出したりしませんよ That's reasonable. 明日連絡しますどうかそれまで堂島組から生き延びてくださいキリュウさん Well, I don't know how well I'll do that, but I will try my best. Yeah, that's fine. Let's go home. But first, we collect my, my spoils of war. I see. Oi. Whoa there, buddy! Not so fast! What the fuck is that? You plan to just walk past us while w h a t you want through here? You can't pay the toll! Wow, that guy is creepy. A shakedown. I feel bad for the guy, but I can't really afford to get involved right now. Oi! You mute or something? Blondie, if you don't want to get hurt, let's see some cash already! Ho <laughs> <laughs> ho, if you insist! Just be short, you pick it all up! Hmm? Eh? Huzzah! Oh, is this the money confetti thing? Whoa, it's money! Eh? Right on, I've never seen so much dough in one place. Whoa, hey, I had my hand on that one first. Keep your grubby mitts off my dough. Shut up and move your freaking leg! <laughs> my, my, my! Peasants really are a sordid lot. Oh, oh, did you want some of my money as well? No. Then I shall be on my very way with them. Oh. Till next time. Wait. Do you always throw wads of cash just to clear the road like that? But of course! Why? At the point you cough up the money, it's no different than getting mugged. <laughs> oh, oh, I suppose, come on, I just can't understand. Uh. Excuse me? You see, when you're not just wealthy, but obscenely rich, physical capital is like dust. It just accumulates, gets in the way, really. That was loose change, I won't miss it. On the other hand, having my precious time. Uh, wasted by these base ruffians like them is such serious loss. I can buy the time off of a coin. Why? I'll pay as much as it takes. Buying time, literally. Precisely so. Why not give it a try if you're curious? Um, give it a what a try. Let fly with a great whooping word of well. Oh, no, I I wouldn't. I'm just not in that big of a rush, mm -hmm. honestly. Aww, truly. 
Have you have you never been out on a stroll and felt the other pedestrians were in a way? Not ever? Well, sure, I guess a few times. Oh, -ho, you see? Then give it a try right now. I'm sure you'll feel the thrill of sending those human hurdles <laughs> scattering. Ah, <laughs> uh, sure, but I don't have that much cash t uh, to burn. Not to worry. I will be your financer for this one time. As a special gift, you need focus only on enjoying the rush of flinging cash confetti. Okay, deal. If you're really going to pay for it, I'll give it a go. Press uh, square while walking around the city to take a handful of your money and fling it into there. Anybody will flock to the cash, grab it what they can, keep in mind the next time you're in a hurry. Uh, try using it to attract the one behind you. Huh? On narrow streets and alleys, you often find your way completely blocked by punk seekers you find. Walking around them simply isn't an option in this situation. Attracting them with a month of cash, however, is. is. They literally leap with a chance to fill their pockets. Give it, give it a try and save yourself a headache. Hmm. Fascinating. Now simply strut past them while they're busy scra uh, scram uh, scrabbling over each other to pick it up. By judiciously wasting money, you can buy your way out of most necessary conflicts. Keep it in mind the next time you're in a hurry. Yes, okay. Ooh, truly magnificent money blasting! For a moment, I completely forgot you were merely another uh, pedestrian. Plebeian! Hmm, is that what being rich is like? Honestly, I can't say it feels very good to waste it like that. Perhaps, but aren't there times when you're far too hurried to be embro embroiled in the petty squabbles of the underclass? That's not... Ah, okay, alright, yeah, mm. sure. Really, I always said time is money is an other buffoon. Time is... Time is the far more precious resource. It's finite. Fair enough, I can see a weird sort of logic to that. Then I've made my case. Take my advice if you're ever in danger of being tracked into a meaningless fight. Just let loose uh, with uh, just let loose with heaving helping of legal tender, so you're clearly loaded. But how do you earn all that cash? Oh, I I think you'd have caught a case of money fever. Hmm, maybe. I'm just thinking it'd be convenient if there was a quick way to make some extra money. Common sense tells me that's, that's crazy to wish for, but I might as well ask. Oh, but there is! Seriously? The very epitome of high risk. High return. It's been my golden goose, and I dine on Diamond Bow. Dino, diamond Four guys, it being head of the theater square. If you're truly a man of means, you'll find your way from there. What am I looking for? Oh, you'll know it when you see it. A paradise exclu exclusively reserved for the upper echelon of wealth and taste. Though naturally, that isn't my only source of income. I've quite uh, the diverse the portfolio. Or, I should say, we put most of our capital to work in a certain system gives us gives rise to considerable profit. If you wish to hear more about that as well, drop by Vincent. You'll find me there most of the time. Vincent. Got it. This has been a most stimulating use of my time. Ta-da! Cool! Uh, that was an experience. Tachibana may have new intel tomorrow, but that doesn't mean everything will be over then. I should tuck away as much cash as I can, so I'm ready for whatever comes. He said I'd find a way to make big money at Fear to Square. It, it's worth a look. Are you alright? You're usually not here. Uh... What am I going to do? I don't want anything to do with the criminal underworld, but I finally got a promotion to manage this place all on my own! Oh, excuse me, sir. <laughs> are you talking to me? Yes, I'm sorry to spring this on you, but uh, are you for hire? I need someone discreet. Let me show you to my place. Sorry, but I'm not interested in any hanky-panky with you. Oh, what? Oh, no, 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 that's not what I meant. I swear, I need protection. You can provide uh... it, no? Protection or not? I'm not doing it with Oh, I get it. <laughs> I, I, I skipped by accident, I'm sorry. You're not, I'm very sorry, I had the wrong idea. You have the intimidating aura. See, I, so, I just, uh, so I just assumed. I will pause in editing so you can read it. Or maybe I'll do some voice work. Maybe, let's see. Anyway, why do you need protection? I'm the manager of this restaurant, you see. We're, we're about to add another line of business on the side. And I thought I would better manage, um, arrange protection with the local um, boss. Usually, business uh, businesses negotiate uh, that with the lo with one of the local families. There's no one boss for Kamarucho who protects you. And with all the lead getting bought up in this area, uh, almost all the tenants are gone. No yakuza family will want to offer you uh. protection. Oh, I'm in bigger trouble uh. than I realized. You seem to know a, lo a, a lot about these things, though. Would you mind giving me some advice? I can't really discuss it in public. Can we step inside the restaurant? Sure, I, I have time. 
Alright, fine. Thank you so much. Please, come this way. Ah. This is Dragon and Tiger's Kamarucha brand, and the owner runs the original restaurant in Suntanbori, Osaka. Suntanbori, huh? The owner there has devoted most, uh, most of his time and energy in a secondary line of business, and now he's instructing me to follow suit. What's the business? Ah. I trust you can keep a secret, he deals in weapons and other gear of that sort. Mm. Guns, is that it? That's a dangerous mm. trade. No, 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 he's a weapon enthusiast. Dealing in weapons and other combat gear from all around the world has been a dream of his. I said enthusiast, but his wife would call him a maniac. <laughs> he has a network of agents that send him weapons and parts, and makes his own versions as well. That's a man who's serious about his hobbies. His wife must be quite a character to put up with all that. <laughs> and it seems he met an interesting customer recently, and the, uh, and, and the encounter breathed new life into his secret trade. He's now single-mindedly uh, single pursuing a new goal, which is to provide that unusual customer with the finest equipment he can find or make. Or th and that is why he's now telling me to sell weapons and gear here as well, to get feedback from Kamorucha buyers from mm. usability. That's a pretty tall mm. order. I trained to become a chef at this restaurant in Sontabori, so I was aware of, of his side business, but that doesn't mean I'm comfortable selling weapons myself. He taught me everything I know, so I would do anything for him. But this, I'm afraid of the police, and even more afraid of the Yakuza coming after me. So, uh, is it weapons and gear and any other legal stuff? No, nothing else. But we also repair worn down or broken weapons too. Also, when the Southern Bori branch gets something new, the owner will make replicas so we can offer it here in Kamaruchi too. He must have some real skills. A staff or something, sure. But guns too? Mm. It's what he spends almost all his time on, after all. But despite his skills, he, the sales are meager because he is terribly picky about new customers. You should follow his example here. One blabbermouth and you'll be in big trouble. You're right. In that case, would you be our first customer? Nani. Are you serious? That's serious. You seem tight-lipped, and having a regular customer like you uh, would come in handy in case we do run into trouble with the Yakuza. I don't much fancy being their go-to guy for Yakuza problems, but I might need to uh, need that sort of equipment, and it's not like there's a lot of other shops like this. Uh. Fine, it's a deal. I'll come by when I need something. My name's Kiryu. <laughs> it's a pleasure to make your acquaintance, Kiryu san. The owner will be delighted when I tell him the news. You're gonna put your cell and repair equipment. Cool. So I could. Ha. Ha ha. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! That's a lot more than I realized. And what can I buy precisely? A piece of lumber and a pipe. I mean, might as well. Cool. Now we have that available. Glad I did that. Well, let's see if we get lucky. As always, we kick off with shout outs. Okay, come on. Um, doesn't wasn't interesting enough. Yep. Let's try again. <laughs> yeah, let's do a lesson in that. It sounds uh, about training a dominator how to be a better at her job. That should be a crazy enough story for him to be like, I want to cover this. Cool. Give me that money. Delicious. Let's go pop up our things a little bit.
You're better at this thing, so might as well give it to you. And you are great at this. Is that all? I'm guessing that's maxed out. Cool. And you guys can start collecting. How do I check where our uh, businesses are? How many more are there? That's the only thing I have a problem with. I don't know how to really look for the businesses. Unless they... Mm, let me check the business tab. Maybe it's gonna be a bit more straightforward than anything. Ah, there we go. Uh, can I check specifically? Health wild apples, a small erotic massage pillow. I mean, let's go. Didn't realize there was one right there. Oh, is there a new? Cool. Come on. And yeah. Hello, Dolce Kamiya son. Hello, I love your show, regular listener. Thank you. The other day, I became friends with a Madominatrix who works at a S and M club. Whoa, this is getting juicy. She said she wasn't good at beating people, so I ended up teaching her how to do that. Really, now? Tell me more, Judgment Kazekon. There was a problem, though. I don't know very much about SNM, so it was pretty challenging. I learned a lot, too. Oh, really? And what uh, what all did you, did you learn? P.S. Does SNM interest you, Do uh, Dolce Kamiasan? Jasmine Kazekon says he doesn't know very much about SNM, but he took on the challenge anyway. That's what I call taking the domin dominant position. But could there, uh, could there really be a domination who's bad at berating people? Please mail me the name of the club where she walks and sail the envelope, <laughs> if you don't mind. As for me, I don't care much for S or M. The only thing that pushes me up is you! Whoa! That's the second time Judgment Kaz Kazikan has had a postcard feature on the show. If you get on air three times, you win a deluxe gift of a cool million yen. Keep your postcard coming, listener. Oh, it's time already. Too bad. Too sad. But that's what our show is for today. Cool. Mr. President? Is something in the matter? Oh, no. Nothing. Okay, so we need one more. So let's go quickly write it up. Postcard master. Let's secure from the secret. That sounds like a wild story. Oh, yep, 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 like last time. Okay, and let's quickly go invest into this. You're a person who is very interested in that kind of stuff, so there we go. We invest in all of our properties. There we go. Cool. More properties means more business. Means more passive income. Yeah. That's what it means. Right. What was this? As generally trimmed. Sent you eye popping attention. Cool, I guess. We can't afford anything unless I fight a f uh, fight someone. Okay, let's go to the main quest and see what that what that has to offer. So I'll be right back. That rich guy said I should go to Theater Square if I want to make big money. Mm -hmm. Huh? I've been I've been waiting all day for this. Excuse me, my good man. <laughs> huh? Right this way, sir. Okay. Uh huh. Well, I have to know now. <laughs> Enjoy your stay. Where does that do door go? What is this door? There's definitely something behind it. Sorry, pal! That's not open to you. I saw you let a guy in. What's in there? Heh, 
You think I'd come right out and say it? Well, let's just say it's a paradise for men. A place where dreams come true. Uh-huh. A place where dreams come true, you say? Yeah, it's a... Uh, it's a real-life wonderland. Get your interest up. Uh, it does make me curious. What do you have to do to get in? Uh, well, I'm the decider, actually. I say who comes in. You want in? You gotta win my approval. Okay, uh, alright. So what do I need to do to impress you? This place is a paradise for the wealthy. If you don't have the bread, you can't afford the dessert. I have to see what you've got in, uh, enough... I, I need to see that you've got enough cash to make a splash. Not only that, I want to see that you've got the balls to do it with style. You prove that to me, I'll let you in. Use your noggin and figure it out. A paradise for the wealthy. This is definitely the place for that crazy, uh, that crazy rich guy was talking about. So I have to show this guy I have money to burn and the willingness to burn it. What do you think you're doing? Have you lost your mind? Just showing you that I've got cash to burn and I'm not afraid to set it on fire. Whoa! I never thought I'd see a guy literally toss money into the pavement. You got a screw loose? I like the cut of your jib, though. He can't come in. Cool. Right this way! Oh! Oh, what is this place? It's the official arena of the JCC, Japan Catfight Club. Ah. Sexy little vixens scrap it out in an arena filled with beauty and uh, ugliness. And men b bet big wages on the winner. That's what this place is about. A feast for the eyes, an exciting chance to double the fun by making money, laying bets. A pleasure p palace for men, I called it, and that's what it is. Not exactly subtle, not entirely refined, but who cares? Not me. Oh, here. Take this back, it's yours. Oh? What's this? The cash you burned. It was a real joy to watch it floating around, so I scooped it all back up for you. Use it to have fun in here, pal. Good luck to you. Uh, yeah, thanks. Cat fights, huh? Never expected to find that going on in Kamarucho. What a gaudy place. But I bet I can make money here. Even with the risks, it's worth a shot. Is that how he won? God, this is... something. The catfights are high risk, high return, but if I play it right, it feels like I could turn a hefty profit quick. I've got a new way to make big bucks. What I really need now is some sleep. Time to rest up for tomorrow. I'm not gonna lie, that is not what I expected when I came here. I was expecting something else. Actually, I'm kind of... I wanna try something new. Hold on. I haven't been here before. Welcome, we charge 2000 and entropy. Sure. Thank you. Please keep in mind that you leave our club, you will need to pay the entropy again to get back in. Enjoy your time at Maharaya. Okay, what can I do here? Hello, what can I get you? Well, might as well get some, a little bit shit-faced. Uh-oh. Here it starts. Uh-oh. Beer. Champagne. Oasis and orange. Gin line. I am really drunk now. So you like disco dancing? Yeah, sort of. <laughs> if all that dancing makes you thirsty, come to me and I'll fix you a drink. I am really drunk. Aha, uh -huh, really big important people there. Oh man, this is not the best. Hey there, wanna show off some sweet moves on the dance floor? About the disco. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> to dance in the disco, press buttons in the rhythm of a song. Use... Okay, to move your character avatar to the square with the next input icon. As you move your avatar, you'll see the numbers of steps it takes. The more steps you take, the more points you will get for the next correct input. So try to take as many steps as you can 
when you're waiting the next input icon squares marked as uh, already stepped one the peak count again. In the upper middle of the screen is the fewer gauge. Press L1 when it's full to trigger dancing fever. A new screen with a series of buttons input icon will appear. Press uh, press them with the correct timing to boost your score. To charge the fewer gauge, keep pressing the correct icon with the right timing in an unbroken spree. Uh huh. The voltage gauge at the upper right shows how impressed the audience is with your dancing. It directly affects what rating you get. So build up your score to fill the gauge. The gauge has four levels. Each level ends you another star toward your final dancing rating. There is also versus mode. Okay, I don't care about that too much. Let's try. That's what I'm here for. Awesome. What, which song do you want me to put in for you? Ah! Not just Friday night. Let's try normal because I don't wanna. I don't wanna try anything hard. Okay, here we go. Let's see what is this about. Yeah, I already read this. No worry, I read this. Hommono no dance. Oh my god, them. Oh my god, no, this is, this is actually difficult. God damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Ah! Ah! This is scary. Oh my god, no! Yes, okay, I can do this. <laughs> oh my god, this is actually difficult. Or I'm just really bad. Okay, uh, I wanna try that again. I tried! I tried! Give me a break! That was my first time. Uh, no, I'll try again. No. No, 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 no. We're doing it again. Come on. Put me back in. I didn't realize you can do it with the arrow sticks. Because it's only set the other one. Come on. Come on, get me back in there. Set it. That was too early. Okay. Oh my god, okay. Okay, that was better, but I can do better. I can do better. I can do better.
No, I can do better. Try again. Uh, hello, you there? Huh? Yes, you! That's right. Th th that's the impressive specimen. Uh, are you talking to me? Yes, yes, you! Took you long enough to notice. Can you come over here? Who are you? Me? I'm Hisaki, lover of dance and lover of woman. You're annoying is what you are. Okay, got it. Later. Oh, wait, wait! Hold on! What? What do you want from me? You see this dance floor? It's my playground and I've been watching you dance, friend. That's that's when it hit me. You've got a talent for dancing that's off the scale. What? Uh, <laughs> I won't say that. Yeah. No, no. There's no fooling me, but I wouldn't mind seeing it again up close. So I challenge you to a battle. A battle? Wait, you want to fight me? No, 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 no. Not at all. You're telling me you don't know what a dance battle is. A uh, dance battle. No, I've never heard of it. Huh? That's ridiculous. A tragedy. Dancing is something people do together. Dance by yourself on a dance floor in Kamarucho? What's the point? I mean, Mahara, Maharaya, Maharaja is the only holy land of dance. How could you not know about the dance battle? Unbelievable. It's impossible to be that out of touch. Uh huh. It's so out of touch, it's like the backwards evolution. You're like a Neanderthal. I think this wit wants to fight after all. Okay, okay, I'll explain. In a dance battle, two dancers dance the same song to see who's better. Both dancers show show their stuff, and the audience reaction determines the winner. Alright, I get the picture. Great, you catch on quick for a caveman. Let's not waste time and hit the floor. Right, right now? Uh, what better time is, is there? Dancing is also because you can get down and boogie any time, anywhere, and, and, and any each time, and any which time. Hmm, a dance battle. Yes, okay. I, 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 I got a bit better at it. Groovy, it's on! As you can see, I got two stars. I'm, I want to get three stars. Let's party! Uh, I'm getting a better idea from oh, no, no, Dum, 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 dum. I am going to beat your ass. I got better at this game. It's still a bit weird, but uh, I'm sure I'll beat him. Oh boy, this is gonna be it. God damn it. Oh my god, I fucked up. No! I get stuck! Oh my god. There we go! The cat, he beat me. He beat me fair and square. He beat me fair and square. I fucked up a little bit. I wanna try again. No! I'm getting booed! Are you kidding me? Come here! I'm gonna beat you! Oh my god. No, I'm good. Ah. Oh. God, this is so difficult. Woo! Yeah! I am going to beat your ass. <laughs> I won this round, but I'm done for a rematch any time. You don't want to stay a loser, right? Give me a shout if you want another go. Yeah, next time I'm winning it. I am winning right now. I don't care. I don't care how long it takes me. I am going to beat this guy in fucking, uh, fucking disco. Come here, you fucker. Yes, I want my rematch. Come here. I'm going to beat your ass. It's just such a weird minigame. God! Ooh, different animation. Oh, that's hot. Come on, let's go, Kiryu. I'm not giving up. Beautiful, Kiryu. 10 out of 10. Now let's kick his ass. Once and for all. God, look at him. He's so cringe. But we are so tight. Come on. He's got... He's he look 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 what he has to do to make a fraction of our power.
Come on. Yes! Let's go! Yes! Yes! I did it! I did it! I did it! I did it! Oh my god! Beautiful! Beautiful Kiryu! I'm not gonna admit how many tries it took me. I, I'm not I'm not talking about it. <sighs> yeah! That was really something! Yeah, not really. Oh boy! You wiped the floor with me! <laughs> What's wrong? Did all the dancing shake your brain loose? No! I'm so happy I can keep myself from laughing! I haven't danced like this in too long! <laughs> That's good to hear. It's all thanks to you, my brother! Brother? What's wrong with that? After all that, what else can we be? We danced wild, we danced hot, we danced together. Uh, is that how it works? Uh, that's exactly how it works. I knew, I knew my eyes weren't deceiving me. You've got to legit, uh, get legit down, my brother. Maybe, maybe you can even take him, huh? Him? Oops! Me and my big mouth. Just forget uh, you heard the word, brother. Nothing to do with you yet. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, hey! I don't think I ever caught your name. It's Kiryu. Kiryu. It is. I have a feeling you're going to be a big name in the world of dance. <laughs> Whatever. All right, brother. I have to go. I'll be looking forward to hitting the dance floor with you. Uh. Sure. Huh? That boy, Kiryu, he is good, but maybe not quite my level yet. I don't want to know what I'm getting myself into. Uh, but guys, I hope you all enjoyed, because I did. Uh, if you did, uh, leave a like, subscribe, and comment down below. I am losing my mind over this mini game. I've tried so. I, I like you guys don't need to know how long it took me to get it done. But it is what it is. I will talk to you all next time. So, I'll see you all. Yeah. So, so again, thank you everyone so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye.